Hello everyone. Welcome to CC's Fashion is my passion YouTube channel. If you don't know, I am CC. And if this is your first time here on this channel, welcome. And for those of you that are returning viewers and subscribers, welcome on back. I'm glad to see you one more time. All right, you guys, we're going to go through this video really quickly. And as you saw by the title, this is a Shein Valentine's Day haul. Okay, it's a lingerie haul. Yes. So today I'm going to show you some pieces from Shein. If you're not familiar with Shein, Shein is a China-based company and they have affordable clothing and some of everything on their site. Okay, so today is a lingerie haul. Now, I want to say this to you guys. A lot of you all have asked me to do certain um, certain things like a panty haul, a thong haul, um, thigh-high stockings, so forth and so on. I want to let you all know that YouTube has changed some of their guidelines, okay, as to what we can show and what we can't show. With that being said, I have decided to do some other things this year. I'm going to still do lingerie on this channel, but I'm going to... Um, be doing something else on another platform and if you are interested in what that is you can email me and I will let you know okay so that is how that's going to go so again if this is your first time here welcome if you have not hit that red subscribe button please hit the red subscribe button give this video a like um, also comment and as I said in my video yesterday that I uploaded I do see your comments. I'm not able to respond to every comment. However, I do want you to know that I see your comment by giving you, giving you, gi yeah, giving the comment a thumbs up and a heart. So if you see that from me, you know that I've seen it, even if I may not respond to it or not respond right away. If you come on here and you say something negative or derogatory or something about sex or something to that degree, I'm not going to respond to you. You won't see a thumbs up and you won't see a heart. I see it, but I will not acknowledge you, okay? So that's how that goes because I don't want to entertain foolishness over here. This is a channel that's about fashion, not about a hookup, not about a dip off, not about what you want to do or how you want to do it to me. That's not what this is, okay? And that's not what this is going to be over on the other platform as well. So I just want to make that clear so don't come over there with the same thing. But I think it's going to be a different type of caliber of people over here because it'll be something different. So we'll see. We'll see how that goes. So, again, if you want to know, just send me an email. My email will be linked in the description of this video. It's ccsfashionismypassion at gmail.com. All right, you guys. Let's go on and hop into this she in Valentine's Day lingerie haul. It's gonna be good. And I put a new battery in here, so hopefully this don't work. We gonna see. All right, so this is the first piece in this she in lingerie haul. This is a robe that I have on over a teddy. I bought the robe separately from the teddy, but this robe is really, really pretty. It has a lot of lace down the side, down the hip, on both sides, and down the arms. It does come with a self-tied belt, okay? It's long. Let me adjust the camera a little bit so you can see. So you can wear this robe with any, uh, other 90s that you have in your um, your collection, okay? It is so pretty. I'll turn around to the back so you can see how the back looks. Okay? So now we're going to talk about the teddy. So I'm going to take the robe off so we can talk about this beautiful teddy. This is so pretty. I love all of the lace, all of the lace here on the breast area. 
It does have adjustable straps, okay? It's really, really pretty. And this is the bag. So guys, I wanna tell you um, something real quickly. I do not have on heels in this video because as you all know, I've been suffering from a foot injury. I went to see um, another doctor on yesterday and he was twisting and pulling on my foot. So my foot is really sore. So I cannot put on any heels, okay? Um, it's a little big up here at the breast area, but again, you could adjust it to how you would want it to fit. But look at all of this lace. It is so pretty. Now, the reason why I am going to probably go to another platform to do some things different, because the very first lingerie haul that I did on here, it has gotten over 400,000 views. And when it had reached its peak, YouTube is now saying that I can't um continue to be monetized off of that video so i'm a little salty about that you know um they waited till they got to this large number of views and now they're coming up with this crap so that's why i think that i'm going to go over somewhere else and do something different and where i can have a little bit more freedom to maybe do some of the things that you all are requesting and still give you great content. So, also want to say everything in this lingerie haul is a size 5X. I wear a size 3X in clothing, but because it is Shein and it is a China based company, their things tend to run small. So, I wanted to make sure that everything that I bought fit, everything that I did purchase. Um, it was maybe two things that I, that I did purchase that did not work out that was too small. But for the most part, everything fit. It's very comfortable, very stretchy. This is the perfect little nighty. okay? It's just perfect. Not doing a whole lot, it's just doing enough, if you know what I mean. And I did get a lot of black teddies in this lingerie haul. I don't know why I bought so much black this time, but I just happened to do so, okay? All right, so we're gonna go on to the next lingerie piece. Be right back. All right, so here's lingerie piece number two. Now, as I told you guys, I have a lot of black in this lingerie haul. I did order some color uh, lingerie pieces for this. I ordered a purple lingerie piece, but it is so revealing that I do not want to take a chance of getting demonetized on YouTube, okay? So everything will be listed in the description of this lingerie haul. Again, everything that I have is a size 5X, okay? So it will be listed in the description. So if you want to go over and even get the pieces that didn't work for me, I'm going to list them as well, okay? The purple, it worked for me. It's just, it's too revealing. Okay, so let's look at this piece right here. This is just a really, really simple, cute, sexy lingerie piece, okay? Now, I do have on a thong with it, okay? But look at these mesh panels here at the thigh and then down the leg. So ladies, if you didn't wanna do too much, because maybe you are still a little self-conscious about your body, this is not doing too much at all. I mean, it's so basic and simple. It's giving off a little, you know, it's giving off a little sexiness. It ain't giving off too much. I don't think you would feel uncomfortable. It does not have adjustable straps, okay? I'll come up a little bit further so you can see the back. Oh, it does have adjustable straps, I'm sorry. Um, so it does adjust, okay? Like most of the ones that I have. But, but ladies, let me say this to you. All the pieces that I bought off of Shein, I'm showing you how much it's stretched. It has a lot of stretch. Everything that I bought was either $10, $11, $12, okay? Nothing, nothing 
was very, very expensive on uh, this side of the things that I bought. So again, simple black teddy, black nighty. You can really, you know, sex it up a little bit by wearing the thong under it and putting on some heels, okay? But I think that if you walked out and stood in front of him with this on, I think he would be, he would be pleased. So you see the little mesh down here, okay, on right on the side. And then again, down the side, down the front. It's simple. You can sleep in this, you know, just being by yourself. Um, it's cool. Um, it's that spandex. It stretches. You can even go to the door and pick up, pick up a package off of your porch in this because it's really not that revealing, okay? If you just had on some regular um, panties under this, perfect, 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 perfect. So ladies, listen, it's Valentine's Day. If you don't always wear lingerie, listen, it's Valentine's Day. I said to you all in the other video that I did yesterday, it's time to blow his mind, okay? It's time to blow his mind. If you are a woman who normally don't wear lingerie, this is your chance to get over there and buy you some cheap lingerie. Something that you ain't gotta spend a lot of money on because maybe you're not that type of woman that always in lingerie per se. So don't go break the bank, go to Shein, Get you some pieces. You can get you six, seven pieces for the price of these, okay? They're good quality. They fit well. They're stretchable. They make you look beautiful and sexy. It's not doing too much. It's not very over-revealing. It's not going to make you feel slutty or anything like that. It's just simple. Even the one that I just showed you all the, uh, with the robe, you can take that robe and put that over this, okay? That same row, you can put that row over this and still feel like you covered up. The first teddy that I showed you wasn't doing too much. This definitely ain't doing too much, okay? So come on up out of your comfort zone. Stop worrying about your rows and your phones because he honestly does not care about that. He just wants to see some skin and some lace, honey, or some mesh panels. I'm here to tell you all, men love lingerie. Okay, I'm just saying. So, and men, you all gotta spend some money Valentine's Day, okay? We still in a pandemic, still a lot of places we can't go. So if you're gonna do a little quiet home, little thing, do that. But we got to, we got to elevate. We got to keep the fire and it burning in our relationships, okay? Because often, so many times, we forget to keep the flame burning and we lose it and it just fizzles on out. So this Valentine's Day, put a little something extra in this love day. All right? Okay, so that is this piece. Now we're going to go on to the next piece. Come on, thing. That was working. All right, so here's lingerie piece number three. Let me tell you. Out of all of the pieces that I purchased in this Shein lingerie haul, this was my favorite by far. And I'm gonna tell you why. Because it is so classy and dainty. It just speaks, I'm sexy and I'm classy. I'm giving you enough to keep your attention and to get your attention all at the same time being a little classy, okay? It's just so cute and dainty to me. You have all of this black lace right here, all around the chest area, around the shoulders, the way that it dips off the shoulder, the lace down the arm. It's just so pretty to me. And again, ladies, I didn't spend a lot of money. And they gave you matching panties, okay? So you don't have to go and find a thong or buy another pair of panties because it came with a pair of panties. Isn't this pretty? Oh, it's so pretty. And if you put on some heels with this, hmm. 
This is how it looks in the back. Okay. It's just not doing that much. It really is not doing that much. It's just doing enough. You know, if you are, this, are a woman who hates to wear a thong, this is going to be a perfect piece for you because of the fact that it's not a thong and it's not a high-waisted panty, okay? It's coming right here, okay? So turn around again to the back. So you see, it's not all the way up your, your butt. It's not all the way up your cuckoo, okay? Not all up the cuckoo. So it's not uncomfortable at all. But it's just to be sexy for your man, your husband. You know, that's it. That's it. That's all. That's it. That is all. It is just a very, very pretty lingerie. It reminds me of having on like a black dress. And I left my bra on. And of course, you know, if you want to take your bra off, and just put on some pasties and I'm gonna show you all. I bought some pasties from them as well. Um, just to be fun and have something cute. I just love, I love this. I love the sheerness, you know. He come home and you got on your heels and you stand at the door. You're like, hi, honey. You know, and it just, it would just be, he, you would wow him with this. He would, his mouth would drop open. Because again, if you're not a woman who wear lingerie, like myself, I don't really wear lingerie. And then he comes home to this. This is just a nice, simple, cute surprise to just make him say, wow, who got into you? Mm, I like that. And you know, then you walk past, tell me, you know, you kind of like flip it up a little bit and then let it drop back down. You know what I'm saying? You know, let him walk past them, ladies. Walk past them and then let him, let him just put his hand back there and kind of flip it up, okay? I'm just saying. Be adventurous, be different, all at the same time being classy, but giving off the sexiness that you possess. And just showing him that you are coming out of that comfort zone and you just want to do something special for him because he just deserves it. He's just a, he's a good man. He takes care of you. He's a good provider. And you just want to give him something to let him know that you appreciate him. And again, it's not that, it's not doing too much, okay? But it is enough, enough to make his eyes pop out of his head and say, Wow, look at my woman. Look at her. Mm. So you are bottom heavy like me, and you really don't want to wear all of that lingerie that's all cut up, the butt, the thigh, the stomach. This is perfect. Any body type can get into this because of the way that it stretches the open panels, okay? Um, and I just think you would feel really comfortable and at the same time, sexy, okay? So ladies, in 2022, it's a new year, it's a new you. Come on up out of that comfort zone and let your man know that he got a queen at home and you deserve to be treated like the royalty that you are, all right? So just, just think about getting this. If you don't get anything else that I show you today, get over there and get this one, okay? Get this one. I'm getting you all ready, okay, for Valentine's Day. And even after Valentine's Day, like I said, it don't have to be a special day for you to put on something to let your man know that you just want to do it for him. It's all about him, okay? And fellas, like I said before, what, what you do and how you do it, it don't take a whole lot to put a smile on a woman's face. It does not take a whole lot to put a smile on a woman's face. You all have got to stop being so cheap. You all got to stop being uncreative. 
You all got to stop being lazy. You all got to stop saying, I ain't got it. I don't know when I'm going to get it. It don't take a whole lot. If you are the type of man that you love to see this, this, come on, you got to work for this. You got to work for this. Ain't nothing free. Ain't nothing free. Every woman, every woman, I don't care what age she is, I don't care what nationality she is, every woman wants to feel special by the man that she is in love with or liking or desire. When you don't make us feel special, when you always complaining, when you always making up excuses, when you cheat, when you don't do nothing, we don't want to do nothing, okay? And when we keep trying and trying and trying, and you keep pushing us back, further back, it is what it is. A lot of you all, men and women, your relationships are dull because you have no creativity. You have to get creative in your relationship. You have to, because everybody will steer this way or still steer that way when there's no creativity. So ladies, put this on. Fellas, appreciate the beauty that you see, okay? And treat her like she needs to be treated. And ladies, treat him like he needs to be treated. That's your king. Fellas, that's your queen. I'm just saying, come on, come on. Stop with these bull crap excuses of why you can't and why you won't. That applies to the men and the women that look at this child. Stop it. We in a new year. We've been in a pandemic for two years. And if you still hear by the grace of God, then you ought to honor and be appreciative of the person that really care about you. Okay? I'm, I can't stress this enough. It just, doesn't, it just does not take a whole lot to put a smile on a woman's face. You ain't got to do a whole lot. But damn it, you got to do something. Because ain't nobody going to keep giving you all of this goodness. Anybody going to keep coming over there giving you all this goodness. And you don't want to do nothing for it. Now, I'm speaking for me. I don't know about any other lady. But I know what I'm working with. Okay? And you can't, you can't keep treating me like I'm cheap. Because I'm not. I know my worth. And when you know your worth, you walk in that. That's all I'm saying. Okay? So we're going to go on to lingerie piece number four. All right. So here's lingerie, lingerie piece number four. Now, this one is doing what it's supposed to do, okay? This is a body stocking dress, okay? And if you saw my second lingerie she in video, you know that I had on one that was really revealing, okay? This one is not as revealing, but it's serving body yada 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 like the other pieces, okay? It's really, really cute. It's sexy. I wish I could put on my heels for this so I could really walk the floor with this bad man pajama that was only $5. That's right, $5. That's how much you paid for it. I don't know why I didn't pay no $10 for it. But let me come a little closer so you can see the details. Look at these little pearls. Do y'all see the pearls on here? I mean, if you went anywhere else and bought this, you know you would spend a lot more money, okay? But this is serving body yaddy yaddy like the other one. It's fishnet. You got the accordion here and then the openness here. And then the back. It is serving bootay. But at the same time, it's still not doing that much. And like I said, if he walk in the door and you standing there, girlfriend, girlfriend. But look at these. Look at the pearls. 
all these little pearls, okay? It was easy to get into. That's another thing I want to stress to the lady, because you know, if we gotta struggle any kind of way, you can forget it, okay? But you don't have to struggle to get this on. It has a lot of stretch, a lot of stretch. I just love this. Her teeth, whenever, CC get that man, I'm gonna be ready. See, I know what to do, okay? I know what to do because as I told you all in the very first lingerie video, men are visual creatures. They look at women all day long before they get home. Some of y'all got problems with being there. remember what you left home. That's all I'm saying. I ain't tooting my horn. I'm just blowing it just a little bit with my old 51 year old ass. Since you all want to keep reminding me how old I am. I know. I'm 51 and I'm damn proud of being 51. And I look good. And that's being on some real conceitedness. Yes. Okay. Tell your life, rows, dimples, crevices, and potholes. I look good. And I ain't ashamed of nothing about CC. Not a damn thing. Because I know that I got it like that. Huh. So y'all can get on here and talk that bull crap if you wanna, and talk about me being 51, and talk about the dimples in my booty, or anything else that you wanna talk about, because I know what it is. And I also know that I can put a lot of y'all to shame, that think that being in your 50s or over 50 is old. This is what I want to tell you all that think that being 50 is old. I'm going to tell you like my daddy used to tell me. Keep living. Keep living. Keep living. Okay? Y'all are so quick to call somebody old. If you keep living, you're going to hit 50. But embrace it and be proud of it. I'm not ashamed of anything about me, nothing. I don't have low self-esteem. I don't walk I don't walk like I have low self-esteem. I don't walk like I have low self-esteem. I walk with confidence. I walk in my worthiness. I'm a beautiful woman and I know that I am. So you can keep on writing nasty comments in the comment section. You can keep saying whatever you want to say, boo-boo. But you better hope and you better pray that you look this damn good when you hit 51. Cause I'm knocking on the door, I'm at the door. Knocking on the door at 52. Huh. And if you live long enough, baby girl, Lynn and Candace the queen, if you live long enough, you are gonna get some life experiences on your thighs and on your butt and on your, the man said I had the lunch, uh, lunch room lady arms, yeah. I wanna shake the camera. Listen, 
listen here. I'm sure your mama got the lunch ready, lunch lady arms as well. It happens. It's called life. But yeah, for every man that want a dog or talk about a woman's body, that's why I don't understand women. When women do that, but every man that want to talk about a woman's arm, her breast, her cellulite, whatever, you got a mama. Remember that. You had a grandmama. And also remember, you got a penis and testicles that will sag and hang. Okay, that's all. So this is this piece right here. And again, I love the pearls and the openness and the, all the fish net, okay? I'm gonna walk back so you can see it one last time before I shut it off and we go on to the next piece. Lingerie piece number, what are we up to, five, I think? Okay, I lost count. But anyway, just keep watching. I'll be back. Okay, I lost count. I don't know what, this, what number this is, okay? But I have this one to show you and one more, and then that's it. I really, really like this. You can wear this as a swimsuit cover up. You can wear this to bed by yourself. If you like gowns, I just thought it was cute. It says, just five more minutes. And of course, I like the eyelashes because your girl wear eyelashes, okay? So that was one of the things that caught my attention when I saw it on the site. And then I thought, this is something that I can use as a swimsuit cover, cover up if I went on vacation. It is so cute. And this is how it looks in the back, okay? And it is a little big back here. So if you have a bigger or wider backside and you are more uh, top heavy this is the perfect little gown for you it is so cute and it does tie the tie here okay so it unties and you just tie it with the neck and that's why I say you can wear it with a swimsuit cover up okay I'm not my back area um, it's not that large. I got breasts now, they're not that big, but this is this is perfect for someone who is more top heavier and a wider back. I also like the fact, stretch, 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 stretch. It's kind of like that uh, jersey type of material, like a t-shirt. That's what this is made out of. But it is so darling and so dainty. It's just cute. Again, you can wear it as a little sexy lingerie piece for him, you know, because again, ladies, it's not doing too much, okay? It's not doing too much. It's enough for him to flip it on up, okay? So it's just cute, cute, cute. It's relaxing. Like I said, anybody type can get into this because you got all of this room back here, okay? Um, it's just darling. It's darling. It's dainty. Get it. If you don't get nothing else. If you feel insecure, uh, not insecure. If you don't feel as comfortable as some of the other pieces that I showed you, get this, and you still gonna get the same type of result from him. He will love this. I just thought it was really, really cute, and I had had it in my cart. Y'all excuse me, y'all know I'd be hot. Um, I had had it in my cart. Woo! Okay, so what day was that? Wednesday, we had no heat in the apartment at all. It was freezing in here. Today, the heat is on hell. You just you just never know what it's gonna be. Um, so I had this in my cart for the longest. And um I, I kept passing it by, passing it by, not getting it. I'm really glad that I got it because there's so much that I can do with this, okay? Um, it's, it's just really, really cute. I wouldn't wear it as a dress necessarily just by itself, but if I was on vacation and I was by the pool, I would definitely slip this on over my swimsuit. 
it's really really cute really really cute and like I said a lot of stretch so you are not going to feel uncomfortable in this because it's like a just a basic little gal all right so we're gonna go on to the last lingerie piece in this she in lingerie haul okay I like that was this, this is not the last piece I forgot about this piece. I'm getting ready to show you another gown let me tell you all about this teddy right here this was the most confusing teddy to put on because of the strap. So this is how this looks. So you see I have on my bra, right? So if you wear it without a bra, your boobies is gonna be out, okay? Your boobies gonna be out. But if you want to spice things up, this is why I'm showing this to you. I don't know if I can turn around all the way around. You have these. bring the camera up well maybe yeah i'm gonna bring it up just a little bit see what they say oops so when he walk in the door and you standing there with these on like hey you know like you don't know what's really going on right Getting y'all ready. Now listen here. If you get pregnant, because I ain't showed you these pieces, don't ask me to babysit, because I won't. You better use some birth control. Men, wrap your pickles up. Ladies, take your candy too, okay? That's all I'm gonna say, whatever birth control you want. But I thought these were so cute. So how you put them on, ladies, these were like $2. Were they two dollars? I think they were. So you peel the back off, okay, and they stick right on the nips. It's hot in here. So that's how that go. So this piece, I don't care about y'all talking about me because I got this fan. I'm hot. This piece was really confusing to get on, but I worked it. Now, I'm going to tell you all, I put this, a male friend of mine called me when I was trying these lingerie, lingerie pieces on, and he is someone that I used to be involved with way, way back in the day. So I don't feel self-conscious or funny putting stuff on in front of him because he's already seen all the jewels and had privy to them many years ago. So I had, I was putting this one on. He was like, we were on a video chat. He was like, boy, he said, the things that you women go through to look beautiful and sexy. I said, could you say it again? Could you say it a little bit louder? He was like, I wouldn't even know how to put that on. I said, I know. I said, but when we are in love and we love you and we want to please you, we're willing to do something that, you know, might be a little difficult, okay? Because this, this wasn't that easy to put on. Um, but you have the strap, and then this is how it looks in the back, okay? Ooh, I am sweating. So it is sheer, and I kept on those same panties that I had on with the other um, the other sheer gown that I showed you all because they're not a thong and these, um, you know, they're not uncomfortable. But I just thought, I thought this was really, 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 really cute. Okay, I don't know if I'm gonna put this picture, um, take a picture of this and put it in the thumbnail. I'm not sure, but I really really like this teddy. I really do. And I like the fact that you can play around with the breast area by putting those little pasties on the nips. I think that would make him laugh. I think that would make him go, oh, so cute. You know what I'm saying? You know, just keep it again, the fire in your relationship. 
you know, just letting him know that you're willing to be spontaneous and be fun. You know what I'm saying? So I thought they were really cute. Um, this one was in a size 5X as well. And ladies, a lot of them have these. Oh, I cut it out. A lot of these, a lot of them when you put them on. Oh no, here it is. They have these little tags. You know, you just get a pair of scissors, just cut them out. Okay? This one also is a lot of room back here. So again, if you have a bigger backside or butt area, okay, and you can wear this. You can wear it. You can definitely get away with this. Okay. You would you would knock his. I told y'all in the you would knock his socks off. What I was what I was gonna say was I told you all in the video yesterday. It is time to blow his mind. Step your game up, ladies. Step your game up. This is your man. It's your man. Take care of your man. Take care of him. Let him know that you appreciate him. Okay? Just let him know. And like I said, fellas, if you want all of these jewels, if you want the prize, you got to know how to act when you got a prize. Don't come step into a woman who's a dad and thinking that you can treat her like a penny. If you ain't got no money to continue to make sure that she continue to be the dad, then you stick with the penny. You know what I'm saying? Because anybody that see a dime and a penny on the ground, the first thing they're going to pick up is the dime. Then they're going to pick up the penny. Well, you will always pick up the one that costs more and is more worthy. So if you're willing to pick up a dime off the ground instead of the penny, why don't you treat the dime in your life of what she's worth? <laughs> Know what you got at home. Don't be stupid and don't be foolish. Now, yeah, you can get it somewhere else. That you can, just like we can. But even if you get it somewhere else, it might not be as good as what you got at home. We always think the grass is greener on the other side until we get over there and start mowing it. And then we see all the weeds and the tumbleweeds and the sticks and all the debris that we got to go through to get to what? we trying to get and then we realize that we need to pedal on back and go on back to the one that really had our back and was there for us hmm that's why i said stop sending me them them long windy texas whining and moaning and crying and telling me what i meant to you obviously i didn't mean that much because when you had this you didn't do what you were supposed to do. And I was willing and I did work with you, but you didn't even want that. So that's why I don't answer. You wasted enough of my time, sweet. You don't get to waste no more. Ladies, stop explaining yourselves. Get gone, be ghost, get little, and move on. All right, so now we are going to the last in this lingerie haul. And again, ladies, don't forget about the little pasties. Okay? All right. All right. This is the last piece in the Shein Valentine's Day lingerie haul. This is another gown. Little short, little nightgown, nighty, t-shirt, nighty. You know, we used to wear them back in the day. I picked this up because I really, really like what it said. If you love me, you'll let me sleep, okay? And I just thought it was really cute. Um, again, I think that, you know, let's just say you got you and this guy just started really dating and maybe, you know, this is you all's first encounter, um, being grown and sexy, and you don't want to do too much, you don't want to um overwhelm him with the jewels and all the goodness so you just want to you know do something cute make him laugh it's fun you know it's good for like sitting around watching a movie um you know just chilling with him okay and chilling with yourself you know 
come in from work, you take you a hot bubble bath or your shower with your uh, bath and body um, fragrances, your favorite candle or whatever. And then you just want to slip into something soft and maybe sit back in your recliner chair and watch you some Lifetime movies or Netflix and just chill with yourself or same scenario with him. I just thought it was fun. I thought it was cute. Um, it's not too, too short, okay? It's not too short. And I just thought it was cute. Also, another great piece that you could wear over a swimsuit if you are on vacation, okay? So you can do a lot with this one and the other one I showed you that said, just give me five minutes or something like that with the eyelashes. These are really, really cute, okay? Just really cute. And you know, you can walk around the house with no underwear on or some underwear, thong, whatever suits your fancy, honey, whatever makes you comfortable. But I just thought it was really cute. Again, another sheet in piece that was very cheap. I think maybe this was $11. Again, everything that I showed you today in this lingerie haul will be listed in the description of this video. So if you want to get over there and get some of these pieces for yourself or for if you're going to be entertaining your special someone, get on over there and get them, okay? So I found out how to link, because um, I know how to do it from ASOP, but I didn't know how to link them before from Shein. Now I know how to do it. <clears throat> so again, everything will be linked. And everything in this lingerie haul was a size 5X. I do suggest that if you buy off of there that you go one dress size up one size up in lingerie if you want it to fit comfortably okay all right you guys that is the last this is the last piece this concludes this haul i'm just gonna turn around again so you can see how it fits in the uh in the back okay i'll step up a little bit Okay, so this is this is it. This is the last and final piece. I hope you enjoyed this video. I um, try not to shake the camera. If it's shaking a little bit when you look at it, you'll know it's it was me. Okay, it's not. Oh, it's not uh, something that's wrong with your phone, computer, or if you're even watching this video on your TV. Um, so again, as I said at the beginning of the video. I'm getting ready to go on to another platform where I can do a little bit more. Nothing regarding sex, okay? Nothing provocative, but where I can turn around and not have to be demonetized on YouTube or have to worry. Because like I said, that very first video, um, they have stopped the ads because they're saying that it's reached its limit and other advertisers are not gonna pick it up uh, because of the content. Um, so I'm gonna go somewhere else where I can do some other things, okay? Um, so if you are interested in knowing what that is, you need to email me. It's CC Fashion without the apostrophe S. It's just C E C E. Fashion is my passion, all one word, at gmail.com. Com, okay, so email me. I'll give you that information so you will know and to, so that you can come and follow me over there. I'm still setting things up over there, so it's not going to be um, right right away that things will be up. So with that being said, because I gotta work, I gotta figure out some 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 other stuff over there. So with that being said, thank you guys again for watching. Another CC's Fashion is my passion YouTube video. If you have not hit the red subscribe button here, you need to hit that red subscribe button and hit the bell notification right next door and click the bell where it says all so that you will not miss any videos that I upload. And then I need you guys to give this video a, a thumbs up. I was gonna say a finger up. Give this video a thumbs up so that I can stay in the algorithm of YouTube and leave me a comment. Again, I see your comment, okay? I don't want anybody to think that I'm ignoring them because if you take time out to write me a comment, 
I feel that it is only right for me to respond to you, either by giving you a heart, giving you a thumbs up, or saying something. And I apologize if I'm behind, I'm so far behind, um, but I just can't, you know, you know how it is, even when you sit on a computer for too long and you keep looking at something, you gotta give yourself a break. So I will get to you and I will respond. If you come on here and say something stupid, I just need to have a moment of silence. If you come on here and say something stupid, negative, sexist, ignorant, you'll be blocked. And I will not acknowledge you. And I'm gonna say this one more time. You do not have to watch CC Fashion is my passion. If you are offended in any kind of way, you can go to the pit where fire is lit, okay? That's all I'm gonna say. Don't come on here with that negative BS. That goes for the women, Lynn, Candace the Queen, or any other female. You got an issue with me, that's your issue. You only got an issue because you wanna do it and you can't. Cause either your booty is flat or your, your, your boobs is down to your kneecaps. I don't know which one it is. But whatever it is, it ain't my issue. And if it's your issue that your man is looking, you need to take that up with him. Cause I'm not gonna stop posting videos of lingerie for nobody. Cause you ain't paying my bills and I ain't asking you to. So I'm gonna do what I need to do for me. Okay? All right. So if you get on here with the stupidness, man, if you get on here with that, the stupid sexist comments about how you want to do this and do that to me, I'm blocking you too. And don't email me no bull crap. Don't email me no penis pictures. Don't email me no pen no no pictures of you playing with your penis. Don't say that you in got off and you in explode. I don't want to know and I don't care. You're not my man and I'm not hooking up with you at no point in no time, not ever. Okay? So I will ignore you and I will find your page and I will block you. So I just wanna put that disclaimer in here cause you all are ignorant as hell. And I don't know who raised you. I don't, but some of y'all are straight ignorant to the point that it's disgusting and it's sad. For those of you that follow me, for those of you that support me, you know I love you and you know I appreciate you and you know that I will always respond to you always. I get more positive than I get negative. But the reason why the negative kind of sometimes outweigh the positive is because of what's being said. Everybody is not going to like me. And I'm okay with that because I don't like everybody. I'm not for everybody and you. everybody ain't for me. I'm not for you and you ain't for me. So accept that before you write bull crap and ignorant stuff out your mouth. Okay? All right. So I enjoyed doing this video for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed as much as I enjoyed filming it for you. It will be uploaded uh, today. Actually, I filmed it on Saturday. It will be uploaded on Sunday, okay? So thank you all again for your support, for your love, for your kindness towards me. I really, really appreciate you guys. Again, don't forget to hit the red subscribe button, the bell notification that says all so that you'll be notified. Give me a thumbs up and leave me a comment. All right, you guys, you know where I'll see you in the next CC's Fashion Is My Passion YouTube video. God bless you. Have an awesome day, and I love you very, very much. Mwah.